everybody, Bo is here. We are back on the van build today. Today our focus is going to be the solar panel. Finally, we had to order a different uh, different set of solar panels and it's even better. First we plan to, to uh, put the 120 watts because a different brand, different sizes. So this time we are going to use uh, EcoWorthy. Uh, Eco Ecoverty, this is high efficient, uh, efficient solar panel and these are 150 watts so we're going to have four of 150 watt solar panels 600 watt total on, will fit on, on th this fan and plus the newer version of, of uh, solar panel design they're smaller but they, they're more power so this one has um, 150 watts in very sleek design all black color design okay. uh, according to my calculations we can fit all four on this and this is how we are going to fit them on there okay they will sit on these z brackets the solar brackets and then my um one four twenty uh stainless steel bolts will slide through here Okay, put through the channel here. Very tight. Then. Okay, and anyhow, it's gonna be like this. Okay, lock washer and washer, and it's tight. Fit this this way. It fits really clean. Okay, it's gonna fit really clean this way. So it's gonna be low profile fit. It's even lower than than the um, standard uh, flatline van coat roof rack. So right now we are going to um, to try to mount, make holes, new hole for these brackets onto the uh, panels first, and then we are going to uh, go up there, uh, mount these. Chances are. Um, these were not aligned with the original holes on the roof rack. We might have to make new holes to, uh, you know, customize to the size of this. But it should fit. So we'll see about that. Uh, check this out. Fits nicely. So it's gonna be two panels side by side, and then the other two on the rear, uh, on the, the aft side right here. So and see how it fits flush with our uh, bars right here so we're gonna have we're gonna use on the three bars and then uh, uh, we don't have to modify any uh, holes right here because they will fit the existing holes which is a plus okay and now we can go ahead since we tighten these to the size we can go ahead um, Tighten down these uh, 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 racks, okay? The, the uh, big bolt here to to the uh, roof rail. So we had it loose before, so we because we want to make sure that we can slide these through before we tighten anything down. So right now we should be good, and we're gonna tighten all of them at once look at this you guys how beautiful they fit on the roof of this van so uh, one ceiling fan here four panels 150 each another fan there compared to that one look at that these are 120 120 watts we got the the uh, the fan on in the front and the uh, Wi-Fi four panel those are 120 each the AC and then another fan so we could have fit the same if if we have if we don't have the uh, AC unit on the roof beautiful
and looks like Ace is getting some sun over there. Ace, you need vitamin D, huh, Ace? Ace, deep sleep. All right, the last panel is done on on our paneling, you guys. Uh, what happened is I don't know how I calculated. I, I'm short on the the ship lab board, like a almost uh, one side. So don't know what happened there, but anyways, um, uh, we ran out of the panel. Now we're gonna go ahead and focus on our roof. Uh, we just need to add the fuse to the solar panels and then tighten all the screws down on, on all the panels and tie everything up. Then we should be done with the, the roof. Fuses for our solar panel. So each panel is going to be protected with each uh, 15 amp skew, uh, fuse. Again, this, these are 150 watt solar panels and protected by in individual is fuse. So whatever happened on the road to your panel is going to be just that one broken if, if any of these individual one is short. So it would not burn uh, your wire or short any other panels. Gonna tie it all, tie everything all up and put everything back and it should be done up here. Here we go guys, our four panels nicely secured, nice and smooth. Check that out. Alright, we are done up here.